Hey y'all, Vaughn Twins here. here. I'm Kiana. And I'm Kenya. And welcome back to our channel. Mm -hmm. Today we wanted to share something really exciting for you guys. Yes. As you all know, the Sephora VIB sale is currently underway. Yes it is. So before it ends, Kenya and I wanted to come on and show you guys some of the items that we picked up and then some of the items that are currently in transit. Yes. Okay? So. Before we go on ahead and get started, I do want to ask that you all go on ahead and subscribe to me and Kenya's channel if you all like videos within the area of beauty and lifestyle. Yes. Okay? So we're going to go ahead and get right on into it. Yes. And so the first category for the items that we picked up is skincare. Yes. Now, I picked up, I didn't pick up a lot of skincare items. Kiana did more skincare shopping than I did. Yeah. However, I did get a couple things that I want to let you guys know. I re-upped on stuff. You know, the VIB sale is a time to re-up on exactly. everything. Exactly. Yeah. So I went on ahead and picked up this Clinique Take the Day Off. It's the, um... It's the, let me see. Well, let me just read it. it uh, <laughs> it's a makeup remover for lids and lashes, and that's exactly what I use it for. And lips, because as you guys know, lipstick can be very difficult to get off sometimes. Mm -hmm. And so I use this to take off my lipstick and my eyeshadow every day. So this is what I picked up here. And then um, one of the other items that I did not pick up, but I got as a gift because I oh, spent a boatload of money. We both got this as a gift. Yes, please show them. This stuff so is good. bomb. It's by Josie Moran, mm -hmm. and it's Argon Infinity Intensive Creamy Oil. Mm -hmm. This is what it looks like right here. I hope you guys can see that. Man, you know what? I'll include a picture like up here, up here, so that you guys can see what I'm, what I'm referring to. But then I'll also include the links to everything down below in yeah, the description we'll make box. Sure to do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but guys, this is the sample it's size. So moisturizing. Oh, we love it. Is perfect. We were just like, we're moisturizing on our eyes. Yes, and we have I mean, eczema too, so we get eczema on our hands during the winter time. Which is like why like my hands get really dark around right. this area. Yeah. So when seasons change, we get it real bad. But this, this has been, oh my gosh, it's, it's been, been so a bomb. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So those are the two skincare items that I picked up. What did you pick up? All right. So I picked up, I'm going to start with eyes. So skincare, what I picked up is this Oleg Henriksen, Oleg Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream. And Kenya actually put me onto this, you guys. Of course, you all know in stuff. our... So for a VIB sale in times past, I've always used the Biosense under eye cream, but it's more of like a, um, it's more of a watery consistency that is, and I just felt like I needed something different. I feel like over time, your skin gets used to certain That's products, true. Yeah. and so you kind of got to switch it up. So I picked this up, one for myself, and then also one for my husband. This little baby was like 38 bucks, y'all. Yeah. Like, it's not cheap, but it is it's vitamin C and collagen boosted. That's what it says. And what I can tell you is that this is going to last a very, very long time. Let me let me just show you guys what it looks like in the inside. I still have mine. Like, I purchased mine, like, in the summertime, I think I want to say, and I still have it. And I keep mine in the refrigerator, actually. Do you? Yeah, I keep it cold, and then I, you know. That makes sense. Because it's from your under eyes. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so it'll alleviate some of the puffing yeah. when you wake mm -hmm. up. Exactly. I'll do that, too. But this is what it looks like. It's packed in there, you guys. And so I imagine that this is going to last me for a really, a really long year. time. Like, yeah. probably longer than that. Yeah, really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, and it's creamy consistency, too. So mm -hmm. it stays put. Wherever you put it, it's going to stay put. <laughs> oh, okay. That's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's really yeah. good. So I picked that up. The next item that I picked up is going to be... Um, it, this is by Josie Moran. And this is the Argon vitamin c bright skin serum and it is a dark spot eraser it says it has stabilized vitamin c in it i picked this up from my husband and i to share i have hyperpigmentation around here my husband kind of has hyperpigmentation sort of everywhere um and so this has really been helping to even out our skin tone this is really really good you guys so what the way that i put it on is i just put about put about three or four drops on my fingertips, I press it into my skin, and then I put my moisturizer on top, and then I put my sunscreen on top. It's very important that when you all are using a, a, a vitamin, vitamin C, C serum, that you wear that you sunscreen. Wear sunscreen. Mm -hmm. Yes, because seriously, you guys are gonna do more damage to your skin than good if you do not wear a vitamin, excuse me, if you do not wear a sunscreen on yes. top. Yes, yeah, seriously. Okay, and then the next item that I picked up is my tried and true, y'all <laughs> have seen this in times past, but this is the Biosense Squalene Omega Cream. This is the actual moisturizer that I use. I love this stuff. And as Kenya stated, the Sephora VIB sale is the perfect time to re-up. So yeah. that's exactly what I did. So let me just show y'all what this looks like again. <laughs> <laughs> this is it right here. I love this stuff. It is a creamy consistency, consistency you guys. But it's not too thick. 
I feel like it does not settle into my large pores, which I do have large pores in here, and it doesn't settle into them, making them appear larger. That's why I love this stuff, y'all. That is why. <laughs> okay, and then last skincare item that I picked up, I guess it's sort of skincare, um, is, okay, so first let me just say this, disclaimer. I didn't know that this was gonna be bae, like everybody else says, it's their bae. Let me see, okay? what is it? <laughs> I just didn't believe the hype, but y'all, the hype is real. This is the Agave, this is, okay, so this is by Bite Beauty. Oh, Bite Beauty, okay. Bite Beauty, and this is the Agave Weekly Lip Scrub. So it's a lip mm. exfoliant, you guys. And it doesn't break you out? It does not break me out. My lips nice. I'm feel to that. so good, like smooth afterwards, you guys. Oh my goodness, I feel like I have a whole new set of lips. I imagine it has like a sugar scrub of some sort in here. You guys can read up on it. I'll list it down, the link for this down below so that y'all can read up on this. But when I tell y'all this is the truth, this is the truth. I didn't believe the hype until I got it. And I just went out on a whim like, let me just try it. Because you know, that now is the time to try stuff. If you right. don't like it, you can just you can try it. it. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah. yeah. But so, anyway, yep. So that is it for skincare. Okay, so moving right along to makeup. Um, I myself didn't really purchase a whole lot of makeup. I just, like I said, I re upped on things that I needed. And so the first particular item is primer. I picked up this milk primer, y'all. I just I got it in the small it. one, the Hydro Grip Primer. Ah! <laughs> Oh my God. Y'all, first of all, she did not even want to try this hair. at first. She was like, I like my Tatcha. I right. like my Tatcha. Yeah, that, ta <laughs> that Tatcha Silk is Kansas. Now that's bomb. You but said this Silk is Kansas. Kansas. <laughs> no, my braces. Oh, okay. So you can't, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> silk is Kansas. <laughs> um, so, uh, but oh my goodness, like I didn't think that anything could get better than the Tatcha Silk is Kansas. However, However, this Milk Hydro Primer, oh my gosh, it's so good. It stays in place, it doesn't rub around. Like one of the things that I didn't really care for with the Tatcha Silk is Canvas is that it was very creamy based and it moved around a lot. Whereas this, this stays exactly where you put it. It's kind of like a sticky consistency, mm -hmm. um, which I actually like because it makes your makeup, your foundation like stick to where it's supposed mm -hmm. to go. Right, right. And it just stays in place. Right. So yeah, so that's one of the items that I purchased. Another one that I purchased, which this is my first time trying this out, but this is the Benefit Brow Styler. I got it in the color four, and what it does is it helps you to shape your brows. So the wonderful thing about this right here is that it has a crayon on one side, oh. and it helps to sculpt and shape your brows, and then on the other side, it's a loose filling powder. So as you guys know, oh. yeah, whenever you want to get like a nice defined brow, sometimes you want to go in with like a pomade or a powder or something like that to help to, to sculpt and define your brows. I've never done that before, but I decided to try this out and I'm hoping that it'll help help me to like shape my brows a little better because I've not always been the best at shaping my brows, guys. So you haven't used it yet? I haven't used it yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I just, I picked it up and I'm going to try it and I'll let you guys know how I like it. <laughs> Um, another thing that I had to re-up on y'all is the Pat McGrath Fetish Eyes Mascara. Oh, you I already more. opened it. Okay, I okay. Already, yes, <laughs> I already opened it. So this is it right here. The packaging is blue. I'll include a picture somewhere up here. The packaging is absolutely beautiful because it's cobalt blue and I love blue. But anyway, so the mascara, I picked it up during the last VIB sale and I fell in love with it. And so I had to re-up and get it again. I actually, I actually picked up, which I forgot to bring with me, but I picked up their eyeliner. Oh, you Another did? of the Pat McGrath, like I, I love the eyeliner. Really? I absolutely love. Their eyeliner is bomb, you guys. Wow. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, so I only have a couple more items left, and then I'll let Kiana go on ahead and take over. I also picked up the Stay Naked Pro Customizer Color Corrector. It's by Urban Decay. This is it right here, and this is actually the packaging for it. Um, but it's a red color corrector basically and I just I put it typically like on the corners of my eyes because I have dark spots there and then I'll put it like around the perimeter of my lips because I have hyperpigmentation in that area and I love it. I really love it. Um, another thing that I picked up is the Hourglass Veil Translucent Setting Power Powder. This guys, 
Oh my gosh, now that's bad. Now this is the best setting powder I have tried yeah, for our by skin. far. Laura Mercier does not work for us. Laura Mercier cover FX. Who else? Derma um, Blend. Derma Blend, MAC. Like nothing works for us, however this I mean, it's really smoothing. It's so smooth, y'all. Yeah. Yes, like I it love. It leaves more of like a flawless finish. Oh my because goodness! Because it's really fine milled. Yes, and it does not break us out. As yeah. you guys know, we've talked about it on our channel before. We have very eczema prone skin. Yeah. Su support dermatitis, all that stuff. Yeah. These items that we're mentioning to you guys have not broken us out. Like they have become like our tried and true. Yeah. Now I will say that I do love my Beauty Bakery powder, but but this. Beauty Bakery doesn't compare to this, Man, in my opinion. It's bomb. It is. It really is. All right, guys. So the last item that I, um, oh well, we have lip products, but we'll talk about those in a minute. Last couple items, guys. Y'all know I had some more concealer. Yes. So I got the Bobbi <laughs> Brown Instant Coverage Concealer. Mm -hmm, we and love this I stuff. I am yes. I'm in the shade Golden, but this is it right here. It's the box, and then I'll open it up for y'all. This is it right here. And I love it because it actually has a wand on it. And um, it's a creamy consistency. And it just stays right on the wand. And I just take it and I just dot, 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 dot under my eyes. And then I conceal. But I love this stuff. I had to re-up on it. Um, yeah, so this is Bay. And then I have one more thing that Kiana and I will talk about together. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so for my items. And please keep in mind, you guys, that this is not, these aren't the only items that Kenya and I picked up. We also have some in transit. So yeah. we'll be sure to discuss those after we have discussed what we actually have in hand. Yeah. But so as far as makeup items are concerned, I picked up the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer oh, Potion. You got it. I finally got this, you guys. I upgraded from I had an old one. Like if I can show y'all, I had such an old one, you guys, that it wouldn't even work no more, y'all. I had this one. Oh, I remember that one. This is a look. I That's mean, y'all can tell I'm dating myself by this because that I don't even think they make the packaging this bright um, or this light purple color mm -hmm. any longer. But I picked up the eyeshadow primer potion, and this is the one for um, this is long lasting eyeshadow base, and this is the anti aging one. And I like this one because it still does the job. Yeah. Your eyeshadow still sticks to your eyes. Yeah. However, it's a little bit more moisturizing than the original one. That's true, it is. So yeah, so I really, really love that one. I also picked up a lipstick by Anastasia and this is the Anastasia Matte Lipstick. And this is in the color Spice. This is a little box that it comes in. It's in the color Spice. I'm actually wearing it today. And this is the actual color of the lipstick. I, I like it. Um, my only concern about this so far is that I don't feel like it stays on. Yeah, I have Anastasia lip, lip colors too. The lipsticks. And I feel like you got to keep re-upping. Re yeah, and I don't like that. So that's why I like wearing lip stains. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah. as you all can see, I'm putting it on. I just want y'all to know what it looks like on me. But I really like, like, I really love the color, you yeah. know? It just don't stay on. All right, so next item that I picked up is, y'all know we got a rip on setting spray. Exactly. I got the travel size. This is the Urban Decay All Nighter. Setting spray. Setting spray, mm-hmm. And I got the little travel size, you guys. Why? Because honestly, I get tired of stuff quickly. So I don't like to buy full size products if makes I know sense. that within a few months I'm gonna want to try something else. Right. You that know. Makes sense. So I got that, and then let me show you guys what I also picked up, which is not really a makeup item, but it is something to store your makeup in. So this is uh, by Makeup Forever, and this is called the Refillable System. And what it is is it's just like a case. This is it right here, and you put your blush or um, eyeshadows that you purchase by. Makeup Forever, you put them in this little case. It was only two bucks, so I really like really? it. Mm-hmm. And all of their like eyeshadows and blushes and stuff like that are magnetic. So it'll just like stick right in here. I'm not gonna open this up, you guys, because my blush actually broke. And so it's gonna fall all over the place if I open it up. But again, if y'all are looking for um like um, um something to house your loose eyeshadows and blushes in just pick one of these up it was literally only like two dollars i actually have one of those um in my cart <laughs> do you yes mm -hmm. but it's by sephora so oh, okay you know if you're not interested in the makeup for everyone you can get the one that's by sephora too. true exactly and it might mm -hmm. be cheaper because mm -hmm. sephora products normally are cheaper yeah okay guys so oh my goodness this item very quick 
quickly listen. became Bay. Listen. I mean, I mean, hats off for real. <laughs> Two. Auntie Pat McGrath. That's right. We picked up her liquid foundation and y'all. We have not regretted this purchase. We have not looked back. We have not regretted it at all. We haven't even picked up the other since. foundations that we've been used that we use. No, we have not. We have not oh, reached for them. My gosh. So this is what the bottle looks like right here. I think mm -hmm. Kiana just showed it's it. Frosted. Mm -hmm. It's a beautiful bottle. It actually looks like a perfume bottle to me. That's what I yeah. absolutely love about it. Mm-hmm. When you take off the lid, we've been using it, so you know it's a little crusty. <laughs> but this is what it looks like. It does come in a pump. Um, but and it has the gold emblem right there with her name on it. It's absolutely gorgeous. I love the packaging. The other thing about the box that it comes in is it's so cute because it opens up like this. Isn't that cute, y'all? <laughs> and then yeah, you just put cute. the foundation in there. I mean, you know, once you take it out, you're not gonna want to put it back in there, but that's how it comes. Mm -hmm. So it's really pretty. Kiana and I are in the color 24, but Kiana is darker around the perimeter of her face. Mm -hmm. And so she went for 25 around the perimeter, and then right in the middle, she went for the color 24. That's I'm right. the color 24 all over my face. That's so right. That's just for reference, guys. Yeah, and for reference, we do want to let you know that this is what we're wearing right now. Yeah. So Kenya has 24 all mm -hmm. over, and I have 24 in here with 20, number 25 around here. Yeah. Okay, so. But guys, we love we our do. foundation. So if we you guys do. have been wondering how, you know, it may wear on you, go into Sephora, grab a sample, mm -hmm. wear it for a couple of days. A VIB sale or the, the Sephora sale is going to be going on for quite some time now. Mm -hmm. You probably, yeah, it'll be going on for quite some time now. So go in, try it out. And if you like it, buy it. I think the price point was like $58 or something like that. Ooh, I don't know. I think it's. I think it's more expensive than that. It could be more expensive than it that. It might have been 58 with the sale. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, it was 58 uh -huh. with the sale. Uh -huh. Yeah. Like we said it before, we'll include the links to everything down below. Yes, indeed we will. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, as you guys know, you cannot shop for a good, you can't shop a sale without picking up perfume. Mm -hmm. Right? Right. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I had to pick up something that Kiana owns, but I have never owned, and that is the <laughs> Chanel Number no. Five in Low. This is what the beautiful bottle looks like right here. If you guys are familiar with um, our channel and you have visited some videos that we have put up in the past, we talked about this perfume. Mm -hmm. This is what the box look like. Looks like. You can't see it. It's all washed out, so I'll include a link. <laughs> I mean, I'll include a picture. You can't see it. <laughs> but this is what the bottle looks like. I picked it up in the small one because as Kiana stated, we both get tired of things very mm -hmm. fast. I didn't really see um, a point in getting the larger one. But one thing I will say is that now that I have it, I actually regret not getting the larger one because well, when I tell y'all... get the larger one and then return this I one I can. You want to. When I tell y'all that this is one of the most clean smelling scents I have in my collection... Mm -hmm. It is. I get so many compliments on this when I wear it, and I only have to do three sprays. One underneath the ear, another one underneath this ear, and then on my wrist, and that's it. Like, that's it. And people smell this on me from morning to night. I'm not kidding you. Well, you smell good right now. Thank you. You wave your arm in front of my face. I'm <laughs> right now. I smell the most in car mine right that's now. That's what it is. Oh, yeah. yeah. I got the lotion on, though. <laughs> I got the lotion on. Um, but, yeah, so this, y'all, very quickly became bae. And, I mean, I just, I'm in love. I'm in love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've been in love. Right. <laughs> All right, guys, so that basically wraps up our Sephora VIB sale finds mm -hmm. and purchases. Make sure that you comment down below and let us know what items you purchased. Right. And also, if you have tried any of the items that we picked up and you're loving them, man, let us know. For real, like, for real. All these items are, they have become bay over the years or we're trying them out for the first time. Also, if you guys want to know how we, what we think about the items that we decided to pick up for the first time, yeah, let us know. We'll film a video. Let us know. We'll it. film a video. Yeah, yeah. It's a review on everything, like a review. Yeah. Instead of just telling you guys what we picked up, we'll actually review the items. Right. Exactly. So mm -hmm. let us know if you want to see that, and we'll definitely bring it to you. Yeah. So don't forget to subscribe and also turn on that bell so that you'll be notified any and every time <laughs> Kenya and I upload, upload a new video. video. Yes. Thank you guys so much for watching. We love y'all. We love you. We'll and see you next time, y'all. Bye. Bye.